When I first started the experiment, I didn't realise that uh, I'd have an effect on anybody, but I have had an effect on Seth. When I first met him, he'd say two words and you'd say, what'd you say? Couldn't say anymore. And then all of a sudden, he started talking to me. How much pieces can you make a jigsaw puzzle? Me? A thousand pieces. What? He took to me and I've taken to him. I thoroughly enjoyed his company. My name is Seth and I'm four. Seth is uh, a very affectionate little boy, but, um, you know, he doesn't have his father around. Doesn't have the grandfather or the grandmother either, so it's just me and Seth. When this opportunity came up to work with the elderly people, I thought it was a great idea for my son. I'd hoped that he would make a really good connection, like someone who's like a grandmother or grandfather, and he can maybe um, have that experience, you know, and um, have maybe an opportunity to have a relationship with one of these people. Think of... What's your dad do? Uh, I don't know. Me? I don't know what my dad does. You don't know what your dad does? What is that? Because I don't know... I don't see my dad. Oh, you don't see your dad. That's no good. I didn't know that he didn't have a dad until he mentioned it. You can have this. You can put it on your head. There you are. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, are you ready? And... There we go. Oi! There you look. It comes out. Yeah, there you are. See? That's you and that's me sort of click when I saw the photograph. Thought to myself, yeah, I used to be like that myself once. I'd like to see him grow up and be a happy boy. Oh, look at them. Are you having a moment there? Mm. Oh, George. Anyway, I'll be right. It's OK. Thanks, Lou. You're going to miss him, aren't you? Yeah. Uh, I feel a lot better that I can help someone else besides myself to get a better life. Which one do you want? I'll hang on to this one and you hold that one, all right? <laughs>